Good morning, good evening, good afternoon. I am Brett Kai Vectra, and I would like to welcome you to the runway. Today we have the pleasure of viewing the Zuhair Mudad Spring Summer 2024 Couture Show. And right there from the get go, oh my gosh, the beautiful chandelier and the first model that you see has this gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous gown on. Beautiful, beautiful work. And I made a short about this and I talked about how like this one was just show stopping. You know what's funny? This might be my favorite of the, and it was the first one. Look at the beautiful chandelier. And we're going to get back to the chandelier in a moment because it has significance for this song. Look at the beautiful tassels and embellishments on this look. I love the sharp shoulders. And I'll say this, like the way the show started, you can tell it's going to be a flashy show, but it's going to be done with taste and class. The way the lights were down low, she, the first model with that beautiful first dress it's one of the best openings I've ever seen. The lights are low. They brought it up and she just like, it's, she, it's gorgeous. What say you? Let me know in the comment section below. I, I just love the first look. Oh, and the headpiece here. The hooded bodysuit here is gorgeous. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. The shoulders, I love the sharp shoulders on it. it. Sharp shoulders are so nice. Again, this is a flashy collection, obviously. Zuhair Murad, excellent designer, love his work. When I first got into watching fashion shows, he was one of the, the guys that, that I gravitated towards. His work is very, very pronounced but very wearable. It's couture, but nothing is unwearable. It might be too flashy for some, but it's not unwearable. And it's it's not um, ridiculous. You know, it's it really, really, really is, is, everything is done tastefully. It makes a statement, but at the same time, it has some subtlety to it. Nice. Love the top there. And again, I'm not the, uh, I don't have the, 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 the amount of knowledge that a lot of fashion YouTubers have. I'm a fashion enthusiast, a musician first and foremost. The song that you're listening to right now is called Chandelier by myself, Brad Kai Vectra. You can stream it. And when I made this song, it was all about simulating the diamonds, the diamond cuts on a, on a world-class chandelier like the one that we see here in the background, on the right? Gorgeous, gorgeous look. I love this one. This champagne kind of rosé. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. The encrusted shoulders. I mean, like, beautiful. Excellent, excellent work. It's breathtaking. You know, I show a lot of my friends who aren't even into fashion uh, couture like this. You know, like, it, it. this is stuff that, look at the chandelier. And you see, you hear the, the hi-hats. Those, it's sim when I made this record, I really wanted to transport the listener into a big room with, with a big chandelier that has so many diamonds on it. And the diamonds have, you know, the sharp cuts and the edges that you could hear the precision of the craftsmanship put into the chandelier. And that's why it's called chandelier. Um, uh, you know, using the percussion and the hi-hats to illustrate. Love this one. This is one of my favorite looks right here.
even just setting the stage with the, with the piano a lot of space for for the record to breathe i feel like this show i can't remember the music that was used originally for the show but i thought this would suit it at least a little bit better let me know what you guys think about the music and the show oh man like this i really like this look right here asymmetrical shoulder now this has a lot going on but at the same time at the same time it works and i'll be the first one to admit i'm not the biggest fan of things dangling like tassels and you know it's not my thing when it comes to fashion design but Zuhair does a great job when he does it I like this one again it's silver it's gold it's shiny it's flashy it's got flair hands down it has flair Now we're getting pink. And again, Zuhair Murad is Lebanese. Like Ellie Saab. Like Ziad Nakad. And those three are, are my are my they're some of my favorite designers. You know, the Middle Eastern flair really catches my eye. Love that silver look. I still say though, my favorite look is probably that first one, right when the show starts off. That's probably my still my absolute favorite. And and let me ask you guys, if you guys are a fashion designer, some of you guys might be. Oh, I love this one. That's the best thing since nice pink. Hot pink is my favorite color, really. Like. <laughs> really and truthfully and so like it's I love when it's utilized in collections now let me ask you guys um oh there's hot pink again beautiful 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 dress made of one material it appears but the way it's utilized the way it drapes Really nice, really nice. This dress right here almost like eliminates the need for jewelry around the neck, really. The dress is the jewelry. Oh, she tripped up a little bit, but yo, this is beautiful, this is beautiful. Let me ask you guys though, Oh, every time I'm, I'm gonna ask you, like, there's a, there's another beautiful one that I really really like. Like this one, you know, the the shoulders, the shape of the shoulders are really. I, I like I like the sharp, a sharp angled shoulder. Beautiful. Okay, like if you guys are fashion designers, would you put your if you know like one design is I guess you put your bet your grandiose, especially if you do bridal, you're gonna put it at the end. But let's say you're not doing a bridal design. Do you want to put your best design in the in the front? The first one? Or do you want to kind of save it for the middle, the front middle? Let me know in the, in the comment section below. Because I know you guys have probably watched way more shows than I have. But I'm very, very, very fascinated. With high fashion.
Look at the diamond pieces that are around the waist and on the shoulder. These are probably like what? Swarovski crystals, I assume. like that color this dress and like this song in, in, the, in the tone of the show I mean it's still an austere show it's not you know it's not like a sexy show but it clearly but but it's it's austere it's 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 regal It's royal, it's rich. I remember somebody said on the, in the comment section of the short, like that first dress that I was talking about, the silver that opened up the show, like that's that's a, a dress for a, a princess or a queen, yeah. Yeah. I really like this one. And it's, you know, like, it's the, the shoulders that really do it for me. The angled shoulders. Very nice hooded look right here. I wonder what the price point is on this stuff. Let me know. Oh, this one's really nice. Like it's look at me in a uh, in in a in a classy way. Really, it, it especially like you know, depending on where you're wearing these garments. It definitely says look at me, but it's not in a way that's like distasteful. Never distasteful. Like I said my favorite, some of my favorite designers are um, Lebanese, again, Zuhair, Ziad, Zuhair. Oh, excuse me, and, uh, and Ellie. So, Ellie, Zuhair. And Ziad. Oh, I love the shoes. I love this one. This is one of my favorite looks. The sleeves are like dragging the ground. And I think it's just coming off of the shoulders, just kind of draping over. I'm pretty sure like they're not, they're not sleeves. I think they're just draping over. I'm pretty sure she could lift her hand, bring her hands forward and it would still drape down on the sides. This look right here was also included in my short. Very, very nice. Oh, I love this look right here. The hooded look. I really do like the hooded looks. I'm, I'm gonna say like, I'm a big fan of it. Always have been. I know Prince has worn some hooded looks when he, um, Prince Roger Nelson, the musician, rest in peace. He uh, wore some hooded looks once he converted to uh, be a Jehovah's Witness. I've always been a fan, you know. Oh, this one. This look right here, this look right here, this look right here is also one of my favorites. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful look. Just the way it flows. Like, it, it's got this ethereal kind of like like motherly kind of just just this is just like gorgeous this is probably this is either my favorite or my second favorite with the first dress and this one easily like in, in the back yeah and, the, and it was last so the, the best two looks i will say are first and last it was done perfectly perfectly Again, the hot pink right there is excellent. Especially that second look right there. 
third throw what happened right there the third one excellent 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 let me know if you guys know any more great great lebanese designers because i really like the way they do there's a there's a commonality between those three in the way they design in fact and so much of fashion obviously is cultural i really really like Very, very nice. Yeah, this section was really strong in the fashion show right here. This kind of champagne brownish. Yes, it's just, I like that gold one again with the shoulders. Beautiful. That one's gorgeous again with those long, long sleeves dragging the ground. Those two, these last four are excellent, but that last one, I tell you, I tell you, I tell you, I tell you. What do you guys think? What's your favorite look? What are your favorite looks? You can easily have more than one favorite. That last one, I tell you, it, it's gorgeous. It's almost something like you'd see in like Star Wars or, you know, it, it's, or like, um, almost biblical times but it's modernized with the flare with the crystals there's the man of the hour mr Murad. great job per usual and we will definitely be be watching a lot more of his shows i like his pinstripe suit okay so let's go back and take a look at some of my favorite looks because there are so many here so many to choose from. First off, the, the beginning, this intro was stellar. Beautiful chandelier. Gorgeous chandelier. Leading down to an even more gorgeous look on a gorgeous first model. Triple gorge. Right out of the get-go. I mean, look at that dress, man. Halter neck. That's how you start a show. Stunning. Studded. Oh, the way the material drapes during the front, you see? And on the sides, the back line is just per everything about that look. One of the absolute, again, best looks I've ever seen in fashion, period, point blank. Okay. Follow up. It's hard to follow up that look. Golly. Um, <laughs> just outdoing yourself like as a designer from get go talk about putting your best foot forward um, really love this one though really nice mini dress again love the tall neck tall collar there mock turtle structure on the shoulders and the tassels work for me here love this one right here as we transition to more of a gold Ah, oh, absolutely stunning look. Again, kind of Eastern, Middle Eastern inspired with the the head wrap, it seems. And like, this is just out of the park. Out of the park. Absolutely stunning. Sexy is, I don't know what. I mean, just, but just beautiful. Beautiful garment, man. This one, again, halter neck, gorgeous designs, beading, embellishments, the color usage with the crystals, knowing how the light plays off of them, you know, adding that into the palette as well. The rainbow the light through the prisms, absolutely stunning. All of these are stunning. Loved this silk suit. Very gaudy embellishments. Very gaudy, but man, that's smooth. Hands in her pockets, too. Trousers that fit nice, nice and loose. I love it. This one. Now, now, if any look is probably gonna compete with the first one, it'll probably be this one. Gorgeous color. And I, and you, I like it more when you see like the zoomed up shot. Because you can see like kind of this rose gold 
look. You see how the diamonds are crusted on there. I don't know what these are. If you see like these kind of clumped sections that are matching the same color of the dress, it's kind of rose gold, at least in my opinion. Um, just absolutely beautiful going across the shoulder, one shoulder look with a cape on that side. You can see the back of it right there on the right. Again, lots of one shoulder capes here. This one was cute. This was cute. I normally don't like tops like this. It's kind of like all jewelry, kind of like no garment, garment tops. Um, but this one really worked. This is elegance. <clears throat> this is elegance right here. Caped, head to toe, stunning. Stunning. Oh, the collar is just like, the embellishment around the collar, hanging off the shoulder, again, one shoulder, caped. Oh my gosh. I kind of wish this had two shoulder capes. Just a big old cape. Even like maybe long bellowed sleeves because just the way that looks, man. Oh, beautiful, beautiful gown. Just elegant. This whole collection, probably, I'm not gonna lie, this might be my favorite spring summer couture show I've ever seen. Definitely one of the top ones that stand out. I mean, just me thinking, dude, I mean, these are like, if you like, and again, not this tasteful. The yes, they're loud, yes, they're gaudy, yes, they're attention seeking garments, but not this tasteful this one right here all one fabric gorgeous gorgeous beautiful pleated kind of sash <laughs> man and the and the color usage is just stunning man oh my gosh I love this big crystal crust encrusted belt loop here or belt embellishment yeah that's just tying it all together again one fabric dress pleated pulled this one was stunning too gives giving us a little bit of the mix of the earlier look I really like this bedazzled jeweled Nude look. Again, single shoulder. Stunning. Belt embellishment. Check. Silk satin. Absolutely. Color palette. You already know. Just, I mean, it checks all of the boxes. Man. What a designer, boy. Like, man, I'm telling you, the Lebanese designers are some of my favorites. Elisab, Tony Ward, uh, Zuhair Mudad. I'm sure I'm forgetting others. Fantastic. Look at this. This one's just supreme opulence. Supreme opulence. Look at that. We're going to watch her walk, okay? There's the back. The cape just covering this, the, the, the arms all the way down, dragging the ground, caped sleeves, stunning. Really love this one right here. It's such a change of pace compared to all of the gaudy silver, gold, bronze, and you know, these kind of metallic looks. Boom. We still have very tiny detailed and I like it even if that wasn't there. The, the crystals, you can see lined around the lace, which is incredibly technical. Precision hand done work. Oh. This is my second favorite look right here. 
Second favorite probably out besides the first one. But to be honest, this might be my favorite. If I really think about it, this one right here. This one right here. She is covered. She is elegant, but she's sexy. It's everything all in one. It's flowy. It's loose. It's structured with the, with the shoulders. Oh, oh my word. This is, uh, this is one of my, yeah, this look, the uh, rose gold look we talked about, and the first one. Those are the top three. And that's a strong top three. This was, I mean, that was the perfect... He literally had the best... I'm going to say this. Best show. And I'll let you know when it changes. Out of all the shows we've reviewed, out of all the shows I've seen, this is by far the best opening and closing like looks in a show. Best opening looks and best closing looks in one show. That's... I should have... It didn't come out right. But that's how... That's, that's what it is. I mean, this is... That's show-stopping. I love beige. Beautiful silk satin. Gorgeous swooning cape after teasing with the single... Uh, the single shoulder capes. Um, and the, you know, sashes and the... After teasing, they come with this huge cape that I believe is, is attached to the short... To the um, wrists... Yes, you see the fabric bunched up on the wrists. The embellishments create a belt, a necklace, and cuffs on this gorgeous, just, oh my gosh, just this gorgeous, gorgeous gown. And it's old, It's to me it's old world because it's very flowy. Again, I picture somebody like Princess Leia, Star Wars, some of the... Uh, princesses and queens in the biblical days and you know it's it's I feel like it's like this flowy covered up little little skin showing right there in a slit very old world like she could have some very uh, some crystal embellished sandals on and you know that's you could put this in the Incans the Mayans the Trojans I mean excuse me the Romans <laughs> <laughs> uh, yo, no, this is show is great, man. This is what it's all about. This is what it's all about. But thank you very much for watching. I really, really appreciate if you watched this far, thus far, this far. Um, <laughs> this show has been crazy. Um, I hope it's been worth it. I hope you got something. I hope you enjoyed it as, half as much as I have because I've had a ball. Um, again, tell a friend to tell a friend. Hit the subscribe button if you will. Uh, I'll see you next time. But until next time, you have a great day, man. Man, this is some great. This is, I'm telling you, what do you guys think about this collection? And what are your favorite looks? Again, I told you my favorite looks. I'm not going to take any more of your time. Thank you for watching. Love you guys.